I think it's hard sometimes when you're, you care about your country, it is easy to get kind of those dark moments, those questions about the future of the country. Is it going to be the place um, that we love? Is it going to have, you know, the opportunities that we had um, for our kids and our grandkids? Um, and I happened to personally be having some of those questions and those moments a couple months ago when I was up at Mackinac Island at the Mackinac Policy Conference. Um, and I happened to be pushed into a green room, a waiting room, with the historian John Meacham. Um, he's a big American historian. I'm sure many of you know him. And I seized my opportunity and I said, look, you know, it feels like this is a very dangerous moment in history. It feels like this is the worst it's going to get. But give me some perspective. Help me think differently. And like any good star author, he just said, well, I've written a book on this. Um, and it's a book called The Soul of America. I commend it to you. Uh, it's a few years old. And it goes through chapters in American history that are really dark moments. The Civil War, the Great Depression, the McCarthy hearings, the Civil Rights Movement, where people like us were wondering whether the country would continue as we knew it. And um, what it shows is that obviously our country did get through it, but it also shows how. And the two consistent themes across all of those issues were engaged citizens and principled leaders. Engaged citizens, you know, who were not political before, who were not engaged before, just stood up and said, we're not going to accept this. And then principled leaders who were there to hear those calls from the public and do something about it. So thank you for being engaged citizens. Thank you for caring about your community and your country. And I will do everything in my power to be a principled leader that you deserve. Thanks very much.